Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the channel, and today we have Mythbusters number 34, I'm pretty sure, and sorry that's taken me so long to make this. We had a lack of myths, and I don't know, it's been a really chaotic few weeks because school recently started and I got my Invisalign, which is basically just braces. So I'm really sorry if I sound a little bit weird, but there's also another thing I want to talk about. So I'm going to change up my schedule for this a little bit. Uh, it may stay the same depending on how many uh, how much support this video gets so I'm gonna be like kind of switching things out so if this gets a lot of likes I'll continue doing the uh, one a week or like try to do one a week because I don't know you guys can basically decide but yeah let's just get right into the video okay so starting off we have a pretty cool myth and it's basically saying when it's counting down in extreme run you can basically move forward if you spam the jump button, so we're going to test this out real quick. Okay, jump button. Yeah, I can see myself slowly moving forward already, wow. That's kind of strange. So we're going to test this out one more time to see how far we can actually go. Maybe we can, like, accidentally kill ourselves. It doesn't look like we can get all the way to the end, but... Yeah, that myth is automatically confirmed. That's pretty cool. Thank you to everyone who has actually commented that myth because it, there has been a lot of people who have said that so sorry if I didn't pick yours to show on the screen let's get into the next myth okay so this next myth is another creepy one which I know a lot of people actually really do like these ones so he wants me to go to the vent behind the fox which I'm pretty sure is like and I'll find it and then I don't know. I'll turn up the volume of the game and I'll be quiet and then we'll see if there's actually something Uh, is it laughing? A kid's laugh? Oh, that's scary. Okay, it's over here I'm gonna stay here and let's turn up the volume My goodness so now I am looking over the recording because unfortunately I cannot hear it while I'm actually in the game because the audio goes straight to my computer but now that I'm looking at this I'm at, in like a dark room and it's really early in the morning so this is actually really creepy tell me how creepy you guys think this is I'm actually like I'm looking behind me because I'm in my basement too I don't know this is this is really creepy to me so that myth is confirmed thank you so much for that one let's get into the next one Ugh. okay so this next myth i think we're gonna try out number three first we may try the other ones a little bit later so you do not take damage from the storm when you are flying so i'm gonna try this in the arcade map because i don't know the storm moves faster in that one so it would be easier so we're gonna wait as long as we can and then we're gonna drop out and then we're gonna use our glider and i think that should work out nicely okay ah i'm not sure how this is gonna work because i don't know it doesn't really make no it makes like perfect sense but I don't, I don't even know what i'm saying but i'm not sure if the storm will come fast enough there we go we're in our glider look at this look how cool my character is right now this is sick we're gonna try this when we're outside of our glider and when we're inside just in case we're actually should stay towards the edge but we do have to wait for 40 seconds. I don't I don't think this is going to be possible, to be honest with you. So what I'm going to do is actually just try to fly this way, and hopefully we'll find the storm. And either way, we're going to die now, unfortunately. Yeah, we're going to be dying any second now. And we found the wall, and okay. We're going to try this one more time, or like two more times, just in case. Okay, so I'm not sure if this is going to even, like, be possible because the storm is slower on this. So, as of right now, I'm just going to say that the miss is denied because it's not even really possible to test out. But, you know what, let's see if we can actually go to that island that we see over there. I'd like to try that out. Hmm. That island looks like we might actually be able to get over to it. Hmm. Come on, please. 
Come on, game. And we may actually be able to try out the storm thing after all. Oh my goodness, we actually fall really slow. I just really want to land on this thing, though. Holy cow. Unfortunately, my, like, flying thing is a little bit... It's a little bit big, so I can barely see where I'm going, but... I'm not sure. Alright, okay, so, yeah, the storm thing is not possible, unfortunately. Kind of sucks, but I just want to see if we can land on this. Please. I think I'm right over it. Uh... Come on, please. No way. <gasps> no way. How come I've never seen this before? There. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's hilarious. You can only get here with that drop, I'm pretty sure. That's insane. Go ahead and try this out, guys. This is not fake at all. This is so cool <laughs> we're basically stuck on this thing no way we're getting out and the storm will be coming any second now to kill us but maybe the storm won't kill us since we're over here hmm but <laughs> this myth turned into something insane holy cow i had no idea this thing existed i wonder if you got like the perfect circle and you could actually just stay here the entire time and win the game that would be <laughs> A little bit OP, and now that I'm doing this, I think they're going to take this place out. What would be really cool, though, is if someone else landed here, and then we just had a pickaxe battle to the death. Here comes our doom. Come on, please don't kill me. You can't do this to me. Okay, yeah, so unfortunately, it does kill you. There's no place on this thing that really... I don't know. But... That was cool, like, even though that myth was, uh, unfortunately fake or whatnot, it led to something really enjoyable, so thank you so much for that. Alright, so this next myth is the Primal Beast's bullet, uh, will ricochet off the smile mine. Actually, let me get into a private game real quick. But he says that it will ricochet off the smile mine. Alright, so... We already all know, like a few of us know, not all of us, that these flying pets, you can actually ricochet your bullets off of, and if you do hit it just right, yeah, you can actually like ricochet two bullets off of each other, which is absolutely insane. You can like slow them down, and that's probably like my favorite thing to do almost, like just to look at the fireball. And I'm pretty sure you can do this with multiple weapons. One I know actually does work is the fireball, so it mainly just works for fireballs. Like, look at that. That's insane. So, <sighs> how is that not cool? To, if that's not cool to you, then you're weird. But, yes, go ahead and try this out on the smile mine. We're going to switch back to the primal beast. Here we are. I'm going to shoot it off of it. And he says it's just at the right angle, and there we go. Look at that, and it looked like it bounced off of two of them at the same time. I'm not sure if that was real, but let's try this again. I wonder, like, if you can do some super sick things. Like, look at that. You can, like, make it go pretty fast or pretty slow. Let's get a little bit closer, and we're going to kill ourselves. I honestly just love mists like this, though. There's so much you can do with them, and... I don't know, it's just the small details that make Pixel Gun what it is. And I keep on keep on... I just keep on doing that. But there we go, there's, here's the right angle that he's talking about. You can do it like a little bit to the right. And unfortunately, I've already tried riding on the rocket ball and it does not work. But you can actually rocket jump yourself with the rocket that goes slow. So I'll quickly show you that. So if you just stay near it and then you jump. No, I didn't do it right, unfortunately. But okay, you know what? I want to show you guys this. Gotta get this jump right. So here we go. Okay, you know what? You guys believe me. You can actually rocket jump yourself with the Primal Beast. But yeah, that's a really cool myth. Thank you so much for that one. Let's get on to the next one. All right, so this next myth is basically saying that if you go into Siege and you wait till both teams are full, you hit the home button and then go back into Pixel Gun and you will be an armless newbie. So I think I've tried one of these out before and I'm not sure what the outcome was. I may be just like confusing myself and this may have never been tried before and I just want to see myself as an armless newbie and as you can see when they're actually loading in you can see them as an armless newbie for a few like milliseconds 
So yeah, now that I think about it, I've never tried this out. I don't think I've ever tried out something like this. But yeah, I'm really excited to see the outcome. Okay, let's do this. So we are reconnecting. I wonder if you can just run around as an armless newbie. I don't think that's true. Like you can run around as it, but I think you may be able to see yourself as an armless newbie. So let's exit this. And we're going to try this a few different times. Oh uh, yeah, this didn't work out the first time. Alright, so this time I think I'm going to wait till it's done reconnecting to the game, just in case. You know, I may have missed something, but I think this is already like a confirmed myth because you can see other people uh, as an armless newbie. So I'm just going to say that this myth is confirmed. I want to see how far that... While I was talking, we missed out on the only chance. I completely got sidetracked. So it says reconnecting to room, and I don't know, last time I did this, it just didn't do it for like a little while. Okay, you know what, I think I'm just gonna stop right there, because my brother's gonna be coming home from work any second, and he's gotta get to sleep, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna say that myth is confirmed, We can because we can see other people like that. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. As I said before, I'm probably gonna switch up my schedule of this a, a tiny bit, like not a lot. So if you do want to see this series once a week, go ahead and hit that like button. And if we get enough likes, I'll make sure to do that for you guys. So, yeah, I think I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.